again. I'm getting I'm prepping up the rest of the dinner. So a little bit ago, I used that sealer and I had boneless chicken thighs. So I marked them that there were three of them in there. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pound them out a little bit if they need it, and we're gonna grill them along with some of these vegetables. You know, I just did the pineapple. We have green pepper. I have a hot chili pepper in there and some purple onion. I was gonna put them on the skewers, but I'm just gonna use my like indoor grill. So let's see how messy I could not get for this when my oven's yelling at me. Okay, I'm gonna put them in here so that I can pound them out without making a much of a mess. Okay, and over there. I just marinated these in, oh, I doubled, I doubled them. I did them in twice. <laughs> Must have been leaking. Okay, well, I'll cut this one off. You wanna be like that? Okay, now I can bump it out. And there's some soy sauce and just regular garlic in there, okay? Now, I'm gonna try and flatten them out on this. Like that. There's one. I always do this with my chicken. Hey, I thought I said there were three in here. There's two, they're really big. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna seal this up. Oh, do you hear my oven? Yeah, nobody's here to help me turn it off. I'll be right back. Sorry. Okay, turn you off. It's not that anyway. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna gently pound them out. I don't want to slam them too much because the juice should come out, could come out. So I'm going to hold it up like this, not use the that side, but use the flat side. Okay, you can use whatever you need, but I want to make them flat, even wise. Not one end is real high and the other one skinny, because of course they will cook differently. I got these are thighs. I got to whack them. Ready? Good. There you go. They have some fat on them, but they're usually on both ends, so you can avoid them. But I usually cook it with most of the fat on there, and then you can always take it off. Flip it over. I'm going to hold this up just in case that juice wants to come flying it. I'm really squishing the garlic in there, for one. So look. Now they're ready to go on the grill. They look weird, but I've said this before too. Oh, Shirley, I don't like dark meat. I only like breast meat. Well, do you like chipotle? Because this is the chicken that they use. In fact, it's a very similar seasoning. Same with like at chilies. They use soy and garlic and uh, whatever else. Anyway, I'm gonna heat the grill and get this all on, make a little rice and have some dinner. There we go. And check my pineapple upside down. Okay, it's finished. I added a little honey. I thought that was a good component. We have some grilled pineapple and then we have some non-grilled pineapple. Some of this, I reconstituted my mac and cheese, and I made some ciabatta bread, garlic bread, and we're ready to watch some football in the living room.